Applause for a new work of art unveiled in Golden One Center tonight. It has a political message assuring Sacramento's immigrants and many leaders are standing by it. Ensuring everybody not only knows our history, but remembers our future as well. The mural was created by the Royal Chicano Air Force, a group of politically motivated artists. New tonight, CBS 13's Jennifer McGraw is in downtown Sacramento to show off the new art and why some say it is a useful political statement. Jen? Tony and Christina, there's art all over the Golden One, so one Center and inside. That is except for one wall. But one county leader decided he had the perfect fit for this art. I think they're going to say, wow, Sacramento has the most amazing artists. Here in the north entrance of the Golden One Center now stands a 27-foot tall mural. And it's more than just a beautiful display of colors and shapes. It really turns the space into something different, something very special. The artwork is called Flights, and it honors the Hispanic heritage rooted from those right here in Sacramento, known as the Royal Chicano Air Force. For me, it really represents kind of a new momentum. The project idea came from Sacramento County Supervisor Phil Cerna, who wanted to acknowledge the profound legacy of the RCAF. Its history dates back to the early 70s as a group of artists and activists who began to educate and promote political awareness through art. And our community, quite frankly, stands for the celebration of diversity. You know, it's not something to be shunned. Cerna, son of the late Joe Cerna Jr., RCAF's co-founder and Sacramento's first Latino mayor says the unveiling is a sign of inclusion and solidifies the sanctuary city status. Against the backdrop of some of the ugliness we see as it relates to um, the immigration debate, uh, this probably couldn't come at a, at a better time. In a room full of close family and friends who are familiar with their culture, they hope it sparks the community to ask what it is. They will see it um, and ask the question, who is the RCAF? A colorful message during a controversial time they hope will live on through generations who pass by. And the project cost $300,000 to create, and the money came from county and hotel tax funds. Jen McGraw live downtown tonight. Jen, thanks.